Hey guys, Zot here bringing you a review on the Mac 11 SE. The holy crap, this thing is the so OP, man! It's the so OP, holy crap! <laughs> yeah, it's a beast! But yeah, let's get into the nitty gritty statistics on this bad boy. Its ammunition holds 30 in the first Mac and 120 in the reserve. That's 30 shots more than a normal SMG. Which is awesome because this thing just chews through mags like none other. Anything is attachable except a scope. Oh, and it has a new animation set. And I think it makes it look smoother. Now, the damage on the Mac 11 SC is at a nice 36. And the portability is at a crazy high 91. The rate of fire is at a fast 90. And the accuracy at a nice 73. And the recoil is at 67. So now, let's get into my opinion on these stats. Honestly... Any higher damage and I'd call it an epic. Annex, Annex Rare or GP Rare submachine guns usually stick to 36 points in damage because it's pretty much the most ideal damage for a fast shooting SMG. Now the next stat on the list is its portability. It's at a whopping 91. That's super fast. That's pistol fast. That is actually one of the only two primary guns in combat arms that holds this high of a portability. This SMG pretty much nullifies the reason to have a pistol, because it's just so friggin' fast. I have max speed gear, and when I hold this weapon, I feel like the bullet, just running through the air. <laughs> Moving on, the next stat is its rate of fire. It's at the standard max series rate of fire, which is 90, and that is very fast as well. It mows down the enemies in literally just a few seconds. The only problem I've ever encountered with this kind of rate of fire is that it just eats through magazines like no other. So what I did was attach an extended mag 2 to this gun, and it fixed the problem right away. And since the reload speed in this gun is insanely quick, like, it feels like it's not even there. Alright, on to the accuracy stat. The Mac 10 series in this game has an accuracy rating of 60, while this Mac 11 SC has an accuracy rating of 73, which is 13 points higher. Nixon, what an absolutely crazy stat buff compared to the previous Mac series. Now, I've heard people say that this is strictly a close quarters weapon, but let me tell you, that is completely BS. It's the so BS, man. This gun can totally go to medium range. It is just that boss. And the last stat I want to cover on this gun is its recoil. And it's at a solid 67, and it seems pretty high, but honestly, it feels like 60 in-game. I don't know. When I use this gun, it just feels like 60. Maybe Nixon just says it's 67 to make it look like it's not too overpowered. I don't know. But when I use it, it feels really low recoil, like just 60. In my opinion, the Max series in Combat Arms is just retardedly overpowered. And this one just takes the cake, really. Thank you, Nixon, for letting me have such a beast gun. Alright, to quickly summarize this review for you guys, I'm going to say the Mac 11 SE is a boss. It sh it's accurate, it shoots fast, it has a lot of ammo, and it's just an overall an amazing NX Rare SMG. Totally worth getting from the Zulu case. I would definitely recommend risking it for this biscuit. Well, guys, this is Zut signing off. Peace, Zut!
Luigi, number one.